With the arrest of Brittany Griner in Russia and her subsequent nine-year prison sentence after pleading guilty to bringing drugs into the country, the WNBA has more eyeballs and more attention on it than maybe it's ever had before, especially with all of the mainstream media doing everything they can to convince you that it's wrong that she's in prison there, that Joe Biden needs to do something. And as a result, you might think the WNBA would see soaring attendance numbers, soaring ratings, but it's not the case. In fact, like we talked about a few days ago, the attendance numbers are down overall from where they were for the last full complete season pre-pandemic of WNBA. And maybe there's a reason for that. When I saw this, I honestly thought it was a joke. I thought that it was a meme that somebody made. I didn't think there was any chance that this would be real. But it is. This is the reason why nobody wants to watch the WNBA. This is the reason why they don't get paid as much as the men because nobody wants to watch this. This is from NBA Memes. This is why I had to double check it. You're telling me she made the all-rookie team averaging quadruple decimals. Quadruple decimal. She did not average. This is Sam Thomas, who has been named to the WNBA's all-rookie team. You couldn't find five women that had better numbers than this that were rookies in the league? Are you kidding me? The level of play that we're talking about when we're talking about women's, like the WNBA, is laughable. That's just a sad truth. 0.4 points per game, 0.2 rebounds, 0.3 assists, 0.3 steals per game. This is enough to get you an award for like all rookie team. And here's even an article about it. The article reads even more crazy. Ex-Wildcat Sam Thomas makes AP WNBA All-Rookie Team. Former Wildcat Sam Thomas was named Associated Press All-Rookie Team, an undrafted free agent, landed with the Phoenix Mercury. She played 24 regular season games, shooting 21% from the field. Despite the modest numbers, she's coming off the best game of her pro career, where she scored six points. That probably shot that points per game average up through the roof. And... Like, same time, I don't know anything about her. I don't watch a ton of WNBA. I'm sure she's a nice person. But this is this is the reason. This is the reason why you're sitting there complaining about the gender pay gap. It's not fair. Brittany Griner had to go to Russia. This is why some of these women are not getting paid very much, simply because the product they're putting out there on the floor, and this is apparently one of the best that they have to offer, it is laughable. Let me know what you guys think about all this in the comments below. Smash a like button, subscribe to the channel, ring the bell for notifications, share this video out there, and I'll talk to you later.